Hey, how's it going? This is Larry Powell. Um, and I just wanted to get this quick video over to you outlining um, your website and what you have to do to pass up to your top competitors. Um, so what I'm going to do here is just go over your website, kind of the recommendations I have. I know this is a brand new site, um, but I'm just going to kind of go over what I see and what improvements you can still make to this. Um, we're going to go over the big three today, which is content, backlinks, and citations, and what those mean for your rankings and passing up your competition. Um, so first thing is looking at your website. So I see here um, you do have your phone number, which is fantastic, um, but this is not click to call. Um, so people are doing mobile search very often these days. It's really important for websites to be mobile friendly. And by having this a click to call, um, what that allows these mobile users to do is just click on this phone number and automatically connect with your business, which will really help with your guys' conversions once people are coming to your site. Um, same thing. So, you know, you could have this email be click to call or, you know, click to email. Um, so when people click on this, it's just automatically bring that over to an email um, to where they can just email out that, you know, information to you. So those are two things you could definitely change right off the bat. Overall, I really like your guys' site. It's really clean. It looks really good. Um, you know, another recommendation I do have is content. So that's the first one out of the big three. Um, so Google looks at over 200 different ranking factors when determining which website is in that top spot. And content is one of the biggest ones you can influence. Um, with that content, what I really shoot for on my sites and the sites I build out for customers is anywhere from 1,500 to 2,000 words of content. Really what you're kind of shooting for is, is being more than your competition um, and also for all the key terms you want to rank for. So we'll go over some key terms or search terms you want to rank for here in just a few. Um, but with those search terms, you really want to have one search term for every 150 words of content. Um, currently, you guys are getting, let's pull this up here and we can look. Um, so currently, you guys have, we can look at exactly how much content you guys have here. So we'll go to right here. Um, so you guys are a thousand words of content. So you're not totally off, you know, the train there. Um, but definitely I would, I would recommend increasing the amount of content you have. And again, you also want to make sure you have the search terms you want to be found for in that content. Um, you know, a great one I found for you guys, window replacement, Orange County. Um, so I'm actually in Orange County right now. Also very familiar with the area. I know Costa Mesa, you know, fits into that Orange County area. Um, but having that search term in your content, you know, will really tell people that, okay, this is a search term or tell Google, this is a search term we're trying to rank for. Um, and this is what we want people to find us for, you know, in the search results. Sorry, I have notifications popping up on my Facebook here. Um, so that's the first thing is content. So um, looking at what your competition has going on, you know, we'll head over to Google here and take a look and see what they have. So uh, window replacement, Orange County. So this is getting 200 searches per month. Um, and I'll show you that information here as we get deeper into this video. Um, but 200 searches per month for this search term right now. Um, so as we're going through this, we can see, you know, Google guaranteed. This is something that rolled out probably in the last year and a half, two years. Um, this is definitely a way of generating leads, but you're going to see a lot better results um, by organically ranking your website here in the maps pack um, and then here in these organic search results. Um, these are organic or these are paid ads also. So this is just another form of Google paid ads. Um, this is definitely a way you can generate leads for your business. Um, but you're going to see a lot higher return on investment organically ranking in these two sections. Um, so as we're going through this, we can see Yelp is the top ranked um, in the top two spots. Um, then Angie's list. So Google really prefers to rank the small business owner over these large national sites like this, just because these guys are in direct competition with Google paid ads. Um, Google would really prefer you to be spending your money with them over these businesses like this. Um, so Google really does prefer to rank, you know, a website that's built out to that has, you know, quality content on it. Um, over these large national sites like this. So Renewal by Anderson is going to be the top ranked site here. Um, and I actually already have their website pulled up. Um, so looking at their site, we can see window replacement in Orange County. Um, so looking at their page, you know, not a lot of content on here. So it'd be very doable to pass these guys up content wise. Um, you know, nothing that really jumps out at me is, oh crap, you know. So if you guys were to increase the content, you would definitely pass these guys up in that regard. Um, so the next thing we're going to look at is, um, so after them is Window World Orange County. Um, we can see from their website, again, not much content all, at all. So, you know, increasing that content on here would definitely help you guys out. 
Um, so the next thing we are going to look at is what's known as backlinks. Um, and the best way to describe what a backlink is, is it's kind of like a high school popularity contest. And you have the most popular kid in school, and we'll call him website A. Um, you have the least popular kid in school, and we'll call him website B. And that most popular kid in school is going to say, hey, that least popular kid um, is popular now. You know, I, I give him my stamp of approval. Um, let's make him popular. And what's going to happen is that least popular kid is going to move up in the search results. Um, so by doing that and getting what's called a backlink, so this would be like a backlink, right? So this is linking back to your website. Um, so by getting these backlinks, it brings up the popularity of your website and moves you up in the search results. Um, so we can see from your website currently um, on this tool I'm using called Ahrefs um, that you guys currently have 526 backlinks from 56 different websites. You guys are ranking for 99 organic keywords and you're getting 13 people per month to your website. I can also see here that it looks like you guys had quite a few backlinks or referring domains. Um, November, you guys were up to 104. You guys kind of dropped off here a little bit. Got down to 27 and 26 in January. Um, and you guys have kind of been climbing back up here at 56 now. Um, so what we, you know, definitely we can see what's going on. We can also see the search terms you're ranking for currently. Um, so we can see, you know, fog glass door. You guys are ranking 28th for this right now. Um, you know, so we can see the def, you know, window repair Orange County. So this is getting 70 searches per month, has relatively low difficulty with a, a zero. Um, you guys are ranking 42nd right now. Sliding door repair Orange County, 20 searches per month. Again, very low difficulty. You guys are 38th. Um, so you can see all the different search terms you guys are ranking for, um, and the opportunities you guys have available to you to really increase these rankings. What I really like to do with my search terms that I'm targeting is, you know, service plus city. So, you know, window replacement Costa Mesa or window replacement Orange County. Um, obviously, Orange County is kind of a little bit different than what you get with a lot of areas because people refer to Orange County as a whole and not so much each individual city throughout it. So you don't really have like window replacement Dana Point like where I'm at or a window replacement Newport Beach. Um, it's kind of, you know, it's a little bit of both. Um, so you guys can kind of play around with that as far as what you're wanting to do for those search terms. Um, but looking at your competition, what they have for backlinks, so we can see Renewal by Anderson. For the page that you would have to outrank, uh, it's it's really low competition. So if you look at their whole site, uh, you know, it's it's pretty steep. You know, Windows Renewal by Anderson, is it's a big company. So they're ranking for, you know, 30,000 different keywords. They're getting 51,000 people per month to their site. Um, what's cool about this is we can actually go through and see which keywords they're ranking for um, and kind of be, you know, selective on which ones we want to do for you guys, which there's 30,000 of these. So we're not going to go through them all right now. Um, but there is some comp com some other competitors um, that we can look at for that. Um, but the page you guys really have to be worrying about ranking, um, you know, if, as long as you have that search term on your website, you know, it's not going to be that undoable or you know that difficult to do. Um, so like if we were to go to your website, we could do command F and we could do window replacement Orange County. So like this isn't showing up in your guys' content at all. So you guys aren't telling Google that this is a search term you want to be found for by not having this in your content. Um, so looking at the next website, we said window world. Um, looking at their website, we can see they have 104 backlinks um, for this page from 30 different websites. They're ranking for 276 keywords and they're getting 149 people per month to their site. So this one's a little better to kind of go through and see what they're ranking for. So we can see, you know, window replacement Orange County, like I said, 200 searches per month. Um, still relatively low, you know, difficulty in getting a rank for this with only a KD of eight. Um, we can see vinyl windows Orange County, 60 searches per month. Window Orange County, 30. Window replacement, 40. Um, you know, Orange County Windows 30, 20 searches for re vinyl replacement windows. So there's a lot of opportunities here for you guys if you really focus vinyl windows Anaheim 30. A lot of opportunity here for you guys if you really focus on the search terms. It will actually generate a lot of search traffic for your website. That content is going to be key for you guys um, and really telling Google, that okay, this is what we want to be found for. Pull us up in the search results for that. Um, so the last thing I wanted to talk to you guys about is the GMB. So this is another great opportunity for you guys to generate a lot of business um, by having you guys in this three pack. 
Um, so for this search term, we can see Cal replacement windows of Orange County, American Vision windows. Um, so these are the top two. And what's going to really influence this is what's known as citations. Citations is your business name, address, and phone number listed on the web. Um, you can find this from directory sites like Facebook, if you have that information on there, Yelp, Yellow Pages. Um, these are all great examples of directory websites where you can list this information. Um, so for you guys currently, we actually have this tool that's called uh, WhiteSpark. Um, and so what this allows us to do is actually see how many citations each business has. So we can see that you guys have 38 citations, um, American Vision Windows has 12, and Cal Replacement Windows of Orange County has 52. Now a big part of actually getting into this top three is actually your organic rankings as well. So citations will definitely help, um, but where you rank organically for these search terms will actually play a lot of weight as to if you're going to be in this top three. Um, so by you guys really focusing on that content and making sure you have search terms like window replacement Orange County in there um, and really, you know, driving those citations towards your website, you know, you guys would definitely stand a good possibility of getting into this three pack and organically ranking here as well. Um, combine that, you know, with the content like I talked about that kind of rounds out the top three or the big three as I like to call them. Um, and you guys would do well on your way to passing through competition. So if you have any questions on this, definitely reach out. Love to talk to you guys more. Um, you know, even if you want to like meet up for lunch or something to go over this stuff, I am just right down here in Dana Point. So we could definitely uh, meet up and do that. Um, hope you have a good rest of your day. Thank you.